Hey family, it's the Mobile Home Diva, and in today's video, I'm going to be touring this beautiful log cabin, but wait a minute. What's going on guys? My name is Timothy, and I'm going to be taking over the Diva's channel today. So, I'm super excited. Let me take you on a tour. All right, so this is the Bowling Rock 2. It is a three bedroom, two and a half bath, 1,781 square foot home, and it is by Blue Ridge Log Cabins. It is absolutely beautiful. These right here are actual real logs. They come in both six inch or eight inch diameter, and you can see they plane them off on one side right here. That makes it easier to mount shelves and cabinets and stuff on the inside of this home. Now it is absolutely gorgeous. I love the dormers here. They've used so many different dormers. It's amazing. So this is your front entrance right here. And then it's gonna be kind of hard to get around this whole home, but I wanna give you kind of an idea of what's going on as we go around to the side. You do have a full basement in this home right here, which is one of their options. You can do a full basement or you can also do uh, a crawl space as well. So absolutely beautiful home, but let's get inside because log cabins are awesome. And I love them. All right. So when you first enter this home, this is what you were greeted with this beautiful stone fireplace. Now turn you around and let you see the entrance. Man, I'm so excited to be working with the diva. Christy's just been so nice. And I love her channel, by the way. She gets some of the most unique homes. And probably one of the nicest people I've ever met too. Beautiful open trusses here. A lot of light letting in, a lot of light, a lot of windows letting in all the light coming into this beautiful living space. I love how they cut out the Blue Ridge Log Cabins right there, very nice. Not that I would have it put in my house, you know what I mean, but really pretty. Big old stones and then that hearth, gorgeous. Turning you around, you can check out more of the entryway. This home does have a loft going upstairs, which houses a bedroom and a half bath. So super cool, excited to show you that. Now this is your main master bedroom. I don't know why I start here sometimes, it just happens. But anyway, it does have a fan. I love still the exposed beams throughout this entire home and then you have this really nice walk-in closet. Beautiful shelves with the hanging dowels. And this thing is, it's really deep in here. Like a nice size walk-in closet. The smell in this home, y'all, is to die for. I love the smell of log cabins. I don't know, everyone that I tour is just, they're amazing. Coming into the bathroom, look at that beautiful spa tub over there. Woo, fancy. You do have a double vanity right here with this large mirror. And then the two vanity lights. You have a linen closet right here. Really nice wood shelves. It's nice to, I feel like if you put wire shelves inside of one of these log homes, you're really taken away from it. So very high quality craftsmanship here. Beautiful soaking tub, spa tub, actually, like a jacuzzi tub. You have your toilet, and then you do also have a shower in here as well. So you got your shower head, and then you have some footrests up here too.
Very nice. I got uh, I picked up one of the Mobile Home Divas new uh, swag merch. I can't wait till she gets that out there and shows you guys all the all the designs she's got. I think they're super cool. I'm rocking the pink today. Got the beautiful open trusses in here as well. This is your dining room area. Great big windows. And then I'll give you the view into the kitchen. Really nice that you can walk into the home and you have to walk through all these areas in order to get to the kitchen, which is set towards the back of the house. I think that's nice. It's different from a lot of the homes everyone's been showing lately. I know myself and then of course Christy as well. You walk into a lot of these homes and boom, there's the kitchen, but nope. Beautiful table right here. I love it. It's not like a tremendously like gaudy over the top island, but it is nice. Check out this refrigerator though. Ooh, this thing is nice. So you got your refrigerator on top and then in a separate compartment, this says you have a produce drawer right here. And then what is this? Ooh, and that's soft clothes. And then you have, ooh, another spot for, it says you put drinks or in, oh, all types of things in there. And it has different uh, temperatures that you can set it to as well. Wow. Y'all are going, going ham on the refrigerator. And then you have your freezer, really nice big freezer down there. Oh my goodness. You have your microwave mounted over the top of your stove. I love the colors of these things and it has the matching handles as well. I know all these things are different options that you can choose, but I've never seen it before. Beautiful countertops. And then the nice natural wood looking cabinets with the soft closed drawers. And then here, as you can see, let's see if I can get a good vantage point of it. Let's come over here. But these are the, actually the logs from the exterior and they're planed off right here on the inside so you can mount your cabinets. Pretty nifty. And then you do have your dishwasher right here and your undermount sink with the stainless. With the stainless fixtures. And then you have this beautiful pantry as well. Gorgeous. I, I didn't really know what to expect. Uh, ooh, let's come over here real quick. You do have your back door. And then this is to conceal your electric panel. I didn't know what to expect uh, coming out here to check out all these homes. When we all looked at it, it, it kind of like it was in a, like a parking lot somewhere. But when you actually get here, it's got this whole vibe and feeling about it. I'll get to that in just a minute. This is your second full bathroom. You have your single vanity your mirror, and then your shower and tub combo. Ooh, the bear almost scared me. <laughs> and then you have your washer and dryer hookups in here with some shelves and then the bear. I saw the, the butt of the bear and I almost jumped. But anyway, when you get here, you, it's beautiful the way it's set up. You have lush trees, rocks everywhere. And it's like you just get to go on this journey through the homes. I love this bed right here. And it's a different feeling from any model center that I've ever been to. So definitely, if you're in the area or you want to hop online and take a trip somewhere, I think this is a really fun place to just kind of hang out and spend a couple hours home shopping because they have some whimsical ones as well. This is your closet, again with the nice wood shelf. There's no light in here, but you can have one mounted, which would be pretty easy. And 
And then going upstairs. Oh, I wanna show you this real quick. So this is how the home is constructed with the logs. And then you have this foam insulation right here, which helps act as a barrier in between each of the logs. fun stuff it's always fun you know like interesting to see how all these homes are designed because every builder has some unique way that they do it and then coming up to the top of the stairs you have your half bath now there's a sign right there that says there is a shower option available up here as well so that's nice but you have this cute port window your toilet and your single vanity And then you have a linen closet with, this might even just be like the closet for the room that's up here with a loft area. We'll have to, we'll have to go check that out. Yeah, that could definitely act as that. So beautiful vaulted ceiling up here, again with the exposed beams. And you can see that main beam going all the way down the house. And then you have your dormer right here that you can kind of go check out, have a beautiful view of whatever mountain vista you place this home on or near. All right, y'all, thanks for hanging out. This home was absolutely incredible. Uh, let us know down in the comments what you think about it. If you want more information on Blue Ridge Log Cabins, we'll leave the link down in the description below. As far as the price, this home with the basement ranges between $133 a square foot all the way up to $165 a square foot. Of course that price can change due to a whole wide variety of factors so keep that in mind go check out another one of the mobile home divas amazing videos right here and until next time my name's not the mobile home diva <laughs> anyway bye guys later you're going to be looking at between 133,000. all right i hope you guys really enjoyed all right i hope you all really enjoyed this home this home with the basement is going to start out between 133. All right, bye. All right, I hope y'all really enjoyed this home. It has been so much fun touring this and just hanging out with Christy, the mobile home diva. If you want, if you want more information on this home, I'll leave the link, or she'll, she'll leave the link down in the description, I guess. If, dang. It.